Hello, 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 everybody. Brian here from Quantlabs.net. I am going to be talking about uh, Google, something very strange and different found on, on Google, namely uh, search engine optimization. A lot of people may ask why is my site not so popular. i explain why and what's been going on since 2020. So Google uh, occasionally, every, every couple of years, changes around the metrics on how they rank websites. So you can learn more here at their site here called web.dev. Usually you don't catch it until it's too late. But namely, there's a, there's a tool here called Measure Performance with Page Speed Insights. So I'm going to show you um, the, 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 the old performance of the old website. Okay, well, that's right, I said old. What I'm doing is I'm launching a new website. I'll give you the URL for it, but do understand that will radically change and it's still under development, but I just want to show you the vast difference. So here, um, this is quantlabs.net. So it's going to run its uh, performance test against uh, the mobile edition and the desktop. Now remember, this is a 10 year old site with a lot of probably thousands of postings, just a lot of extraneous images, uh, scripts because this is built on WordPress and third party. Uh, scripts in WordPress. So here we are. So this is the big test right here, Core Web Vitals Assessment. So when you go through this, you'll start to learn about things about um, uh, what they call Web Core Tools. Okay, so when you start failing here, Web Core Vitals, sorry, uh, to, to, to generate this test, and it tests all the different new metrics that Google's now started to introduce and launched uh, in the summer of uh, 2021. So a lot of sites are not going to measure up to this. So you see here, my site's only measuring at 30 out of 100. And uh, generally, you need to be, to stay relevant in Google now with this, these new metrics, you have to stay relevant with a score of over 90, okay? so. When you get that kind of score currently on that site, quantlabs.net, and that's the mobile edition, okay? So you, you can do this on your own time. But that's the mobile, then there's the desktop, which is usually better. Uh, we're at uh, 74, which is okay, I guess. But um, if I go into my blog, which is majority where my traffic comes from, okay? So the quantlabs.net is, is fine, but I'm gonna let this run. So that's where most of the bulk of my content is. And this is where it's gonna start to show um, the performance is really, really not good. Anyway, so let's go on to the new URL, new domain. So I have this new one called quant-labs.net. Uh, dot, dot so it's quant-labs.net. Here's the scores we're getting. This is again, WordPress. No images, no WordPress plugins. So it's a fairly new site, so we're able to get a performance of 99, which you want to obviously be in the green 90 or over. That's the mobile, and this is the desktop. Okay, so we're at 100. Okay, so if we're able to score throughout the site over 90, we should be good and keep the site to rank and do well. That's with the new URL. So if you visit this, this is going to radically change with or without new content by the time you see this. But the idea here is to maintain this 90 or higher. So check in back to quantlabs.net slash blog. Again, we fail that web court, but look, look at how low the score is, 28. So as long as your site's this low, I'd even say as low as 70 or lower, your site's gonna lose relevancy, okay? It will start to uh, have lower rankings. Fewer people will see it, fewer stuff will get exposed on your site. And a lot of it has to do with your loading time of the site. And there's probably different ways to go around doing that. There's so many images, like thousands of images for me to go through. And I'm gonna be truthful, I can't be bothered. I'd rather just start afresh. It's like looking at a, if you're gonna buy a condemned home and try and do a reno on it, you go, oh, why? It's a waste, it's a waste of time and money. Whereas opposed to if you blow up the house, start over with a new website, like what I'm doing here, this is where we're at and we can start building from there and get results faster um, and sooner, 
uh, sooner and faster. But this is why you're seeing this, and this is why I'm doing the Quant Labs uh, hyphen Quant hyphen Labs dot net. So just so you know what's going on, uh, and this is the transparency. And again, just as a from a search engine optimization perspective, Google pretty well rules the roost here. Um, what they say, what they do, these are new metrics that are going to be moving forward. More sites are going to um, fall away because they're not going to update their website to get this kind of performance. And it's going to hurt their uh, competitiveness, probably hurt uh, their livelihood. But the question is, I have, is it like, why are they making this so high, 90 to 100? Because there's like millions upon millions of websites out there. And for those that get the 90 or higher, they'll be fine. But those that are in, in, in below 90 will suffer. And as more sites optimize, which they, they'll be forced to by using these metrics, um, they will lose relevancy. And as more sites do upgrade or new, new sites that do upgrade more with, the, with these type of standards in terms of the metrics here, they'll start to outcompete the older sites. And again, that will hurt your livelihood uh, as well, and da da da. And that's what has been happening with my site, qualabs.net, with this pathetic score. As I said, this has been in kicked in the high gear since June, July of this year. But they introduced it, announced it last year, but they've really started to really go hog wild on this. So I'll let you you go through what they're looking at in terms of speed. Um, usability, da da da, all that stuff. But the key here thing that they're using now to measure websites is this Web Vitals, Core Web Vitals Assessment, okay? Leave it at that, I'm gonna shut up and uh, hopefully I'll explain things later.